Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Jaeger the Viking here, bringing you some UFC Undisputed 3 shit. Ab ah, accidentally taunted instead of uh, going and touching gloves there. Now everyone thinks I'm a dick. I meant to touch gloves, guys. I'm sorry. Did the wrong thing there. But um, anyway, made the move up to the UFC here, as you see. Got a tough opponent right now. Now he's got better stand-up than me, a 3.5-inch reach advantage. Ground game is about the same, and his clinch game is quite a bit better than mine. So, you know, all around, this guy's a better fighter, and I definitely need to make sure I play this one well. You know, I need to make sure I'm smart in this one if I want to try to come out on top here. I don't want my UFC debut to be a bad one, so I'm going to try my best to do well here. But let's see, want to try to toss him from the clinch, but does not look like he's going to let me. Let's see if I can get a takedown. Nah, he's not going to let me get that double leg. Ooh, nice hooks right there, though. But I'm um, sorry I haven't uploaded so much this past week. I had a really busy week at school, but now the week's over, and I can't imagine I'll have another busy week like that anytime soon. So should be getting back to, like, five, six uploads a week, maybe more. We'll see how it goes. But, uh, got the fight on the ground here. Let's see what we can do with it. Not much. All right, he gets the reversal and ends up on top. Let's see if I can reverse that right back. All right, at least power out of here. All right, come on, get me out. All right, fortunately, I was able to power out without letting him do much while on top there. And I'm doing a good job, done a good amount of damage to the midsection. Maybe I should go after the midsection a bit more. Nice hook on his end there. I definitely need to protect myself a bit better. I can't afford to be taking heavy shots like this from a better fighter than me, a stronger fighter than me. No, he's definitely got more knockout power, so him connecting with the same amount of shots as me is not going to work in my favor. I need to make sure I'm connecting with more shots and, you know, connecting with effective shots more often. Let's see if I can push him off. Please let me push him off. All right, fortunately able to do so. Went for the uppercut there, but he did not let me connect. He connected with some nice shots there. Getting into the clinch. Maybe we can get some knees going. Get the takedown. All right, I need to make sure I control him on the ground here. I can't afford to have this be another reversal situation. Connecting with some nice shots there. Getting the grapple block and uh, not enough time to do anything anyway. He gets the reversal. But had I been able to transition, I really wouldn't have been able to do much. I wouldn't have tried to transition quite when I did. Uh, you know, had... Damn it, I forgot to read the thing. But I wouldn't have tried to transition when I did had there been more time. But I just had to try to go for it. Didn't work out. But solid first round on my end, I'd say. I'm pretty happy with the first round. This is a really tough fighter. So, you know, the fact that it, I actually did more damage in the first round is definitely a good sign. If I can keep it up, then I will come out on top. But, ooh, he's connecting with some monster shots early in the round. Some really nasty shots. Jeez. All right, come on, push him off. Uh, all right, let's see. Gonna try to control him maybe a bit in the clinch. Do I even want to try that? I don't know if that's something I want to be doing. All right, we're getting out of the clinch there. I don't know if I'm going to try to get back into it. Clinch isn't really where I want to be with him either. Um, I guess if we're standing the clinch, it doesn't hurt to be there. But, yeah, I think definitely where I want to be is uh, on the ground. And, you know, getting into the clinch... I only get into the clinch to try to get him on the ground, but that's not working out either. All right, let's see if I can get a takedown. There we go. Got it. Got the transition. Don't want to get ahead of myself, though, so let's see if we can control him here. What? I was grapple blocking. I didn't even do anything. That's so frustrating. I go to grapple block. I'm not even doing anything, and then he reverses nothing. And ends up on top of me. That's so annoying. I had him mounted. I, I'm in the best position you can be in on the ground. And he, you know, just reverses me not even attempting to do anything. That's not fair. Ooh, nasty shot on his end. All right, let's see. All right, fortunately, I was able to push him off there without letting him do too much on the ground. But I'm starting to take a solid amount of head damage, so... I definitely need to start watching out here. Got to start protecting myself better. And, ooh, he's just connecting with those quick shots. That's what I need to watch out for. It's the shots that you don't expect to do much damage that really kill you. All right, come on. Getting into the clinch. Nice knee there. And can I get him on the ground? Uh, he's got me against the cage. Push. Let's see. Push him off. Trying to force him off me. There we go. All right, come on. I need to try to control him here. Or do something, you know, to benefit myself. Can I push him to the cage? Nope, he's going to get me on the ground. All right. 
Just got to make sure he can't do much here. Uh, gonna push him. No, not gonna let me do that. All right. Ooh, ooh got me mounted. All right. I just need to control him here. 30 seconds left. He's gonna stand up. He realizes that I'm not gonna let him do much on the ground there. I was just trying to control him with my legs, make sure he couldn't transition. And I'm just going after him with some body shots, some kicks to the body. I would like to go after his head, but I don't really think now's time. Ooh, he went for a flying neither at the end of the round. That would not have been good news for me if he would have had an extra couple of seconds and if that one would have landed. But stay patient, opportunity will come. And you're having way too many of your transitions reversed. So, uh, I don't know. I mean, I am having a few transitions reversed. And stay patient. I guess I'll try my best. But going into round three here, I really need to make sure I don't take much damage. I'm go... Uh, I don't know. Am I going to do that? I'm thinking I want to throw some body shots. But in the same sense, I do still have to do quite a bit of damage to his body before it'll be effective. You know what, I guess I'll throw some body shots here, just want to make sure I protect my head, that's kind of key right now. So if I could do some damage to his body, I definitely need to learn head kicks as soon as possible, otherwise, yeah, I won't be able to do much damage in situations like this. Because right now I'm a bit afraid to go in there throwing hooks, you know, throwing heavy punches to the head, so I'm trying to throw kicks. But, you know, I don't have those head kicks, I can't do too much, you know, just punishing his midsection. But let's see. Ah, oh, tried to get him with a uh, toss there, but he's not letting me. Let's see. Can I power out of here? Muscle my way out. I really do not want him to throw me here. So let's see if I can force my way out of here. Got me pinned against the cage, though. Come on. He may be the stronger fighter, but can I make up for this in a heart? Nah, not really. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I cannot let him do that. I cannot let him get any big knees in here. This is nerve-wracking. I've taken so much damage to the head. All right, let's just throw some punches. Uh-oh. Uh, with the amount of damage I've taken, I cannot afford to get hit with anything. That's why you're seeing me be really cautious here in this last round. I mean, you see all the damage I've taken. He could probably rock me with a body shot pretty soon, too. So I, I need to start being even more cautious. But let's see. Gonna try to get a reversal here and able to get it. All right, fortunately able to get the reversal there. But, ah... Uh, Oh, nice. Getting an other reversal. I'm doing a good job with reversals here. Let's see. Try to push me again. Oh, he's going for a triangle. I was expecting him to try to push me. All right. Let's see. I need to escape. That would be awful to get tapped. All right. Come on. Come on. I need to up my submission defense. Okay. Oh, this is a close one, but I think I'm going to be able to escape. Able to escape. Got him on the ground. I'm on top, but I don't know what to do. I don't have stamina right now. I, okay, got my stamina back. Let's see. I want him to try to push me off here, and then I'm going to... No, nothing's happening right now. I, what I, uh, I wanted to try to get a reversal there, but he did not let me. 20 seconds left. Going in for a takedown. Can I get it? I don't know if I'm ahead right now in regards to points. Let's see. Oh, shit. Got me rocked. Please don't let him finish me. Call the fight. There. Oh, thank God. All right. Made it to the end of the fight, fortunately. If this is a loss, it's by decision. He got me rocked and dropped me at the end there. I hope that wasn't, you know, a big uh, a big game changer right there. You know, I, I thought maybe I needed to do some damage at the end there. I, I really couldn't tell who was ahead in points. Hopefully having him drop me there didn't, you know, lose me the fight. But, ooh, there's that nice uppercut and just dropped me. Fortunately, it was only a TKO. Imagine if I would have gotten knocked out with five seconds left in the third round. All right, let's skip ahead. I want to see who won the fight. Here we are. Judges have rendered their decisions. And here is Bruce Buffer. We're not going to listen to him, though. Come on. I really hope they give me this call. I'm wondering if I press to skip this now, if I would just get past Bruce. All right, here we go. They're giving him the... Ah, they gave him the fight by one point from each judge. Damn it. Oh, that is so frustrating. Losing by decision. Oh, great fight, though. Ah, oh, I don't know. This is just frustrating. All right, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Would I have won the fight if I didn't get wild at the end there and get dropped? You know, was that uppercut what lost me the fight or would I have lost anyway? I'd love to hear. But anyway, that's it, guys. I definitely took a lot more damage in this fight, so I guess he deserved the W. But anyway, that's it. Really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. 
I'm out.